we are today in Fort Lauderdale, headed over to one of our clients' homes to see a really super cool jellyfish aquarium and uh, see this really intense, beautiful new home. Well, here we are in Fort Lauderdale today in the Seven Isles neighborhood. We're gonna go on in to the client's newly completed home and it's really a stunning place. It's two lots with quite a beautiful, fancy South Florida home. We've got your living wall up here. We've got a beautiful oak tree with a pond up front and it's something else. We're gonna go on in and see a really spectacular jellyfish aquarium. Come on in. And you come right into the front entry and wow, there it is, jellyfish. When we first delivered the aquarium into the home, we went through the garage, down a hallway, around this island and in. That entry into the front of the house was too complicated and it's a very heavy aquarium. But the aquarium was delivered well over a year ago and put in place during construction. The cool thing is, is it's see-through. It must be really spectacular in the nighttime. These really unique uh, doors underneath all open up and you can see just a really uh, big filter sump area. We've got a couple protein skimmers, our floss, our Kemi Pure Blue down there. On this side here, we have our magnet. There's our uh, couple of Deltec pumps underneath. On this door, there's another hidden door in here, and you have your controller for the light to change the lights from blue, green, red, or whatever, your UV sterilizers up there. And then above, when we add the jellyfish a little later, you'll see all these doors open up for really great access above the aquarium. And on the other side, we have the bar area. This door here opens all the way up too. So you have full access on this side. You can, we put a blanket down and we stand on top of here when we do need to get on top to service. And then on this side here, we have our RO unit and we actually have drainage connected to outside and the chiller runs under the slab. So this client had gone to Stake 954, which is the huge 20-footer that we put over here at the uh, W Hotel. And that aquarium was the impetus for the client being interested when they built this new house and having their own jellyfish divider tank that was, again, a see-through aquarium like we have at Stake 954. And they were just elated that we would be able to build such a beautiful aquarium for them in their house. And there's right now about 45 jellyfish in. And today we're gonna to put 20 more jellyfish in, that's right. They're gonna be about this big, probably three inches or so, maybe a couple four inch jellies. And then it's really gonna be filled with jellyfish, a lot of jellyfish. So we have inside the box here, our aquaculture jellyfish from our lab in our facilities. They're inside of here in a double bag. I'm gonna probably lift the whole bags up and then put them into the aquarium. We have plenty of space in the sump for the displacement of the extra water. And then I'll roll the bags open and start to acclimate them nice and slowly. I also brought some new baby Brian Artemia that we're gonna put in after all the jellyfish are in and happy and give them a little special treat of some new food. I'm gonna say this water is maybe two or three degrees cooler than the water I have in the bags from the lab, which is perfectly fine. But salinity is the big one with jellyfish. So right now we have uh, putting in some of the first water in here to start acclimating. So we've been adding water and acclimating for over 20 minutes now. I'm gonna put the first jellyfish in and see how he behaves. So we can get one of these guys out and simply carry him into the aquarium and see what he does. He's already pulsing, so he's got good buoyancy. The salinity was the same. Yeah, he'll get into the current down there and push across. I'm gonna go ahead and release the other 19 jellyfish that are going in right now, and we'll let them float into their new home.
So we have the uh, Artemia here, Napoli, and we're gonna pour that into the aquarium right now. That's gonna be some really great food, a nice little treat for everybody. And they're gonna be so happy. They've gone into the middle and the flow has pushed them up, so they're really accolading super well. And now we're gonna have a ton of jellyfish. There'll be over 60 jellyfish in this over 900, 950 gallon jellyfish aquarium here in Fort Lauderdale. My dad told me as an aquarium guy a long time ago that a professional never spills a drop. 